I'm Jerry Corman, music director of National Dance Institute, and today on NDI Jams, we have the second installment of a workshop by Leo Sandoval. Mr. Sandoval is the artist in residence for National Dance Institute this year, and this is a body percussion workshop which is steeped in the rhythms of Brazil. It is so much fun. Enjoy. Hi everyone, my name is Leonardo Sandoval, the artist in residency at the National Dance Institute and I'm so glad to be back over here on Instagram to teach you guys another class. Yes, this is already my second class with you guys. Um, last time we did some tap dance class and this time we are about to do a little bit of body percussion. So if you are not here last time for, uh, for our class, don't worry. I mean, you can still take the class. If you just scroll back a little bit, you can find the class over there. But if you didn't watch it, there is no problem at all. One thing that I will be using uh, from the last class is just the concept of three and a break. So our combination, the combination that we will be doing, uh, will have the same concept that we had from the, our last class. So it which is the tree and a break. So what is a tree and a break? Uh, you want to know if you're not here before? Here it goes. It's just like a musical phrase that we will, re we will be repeating um, for three times. And then when you think that we're going to repeat for the fourth time, we actually do something completely different that will be our break. Okay? So I'll stop talking and we will dive in into our lesson. Okay? Let's go. Great. So let's start learning how this combination will go. Um, and it's divided uh, in some steps that we will do with our feet and some stuff that we will do with our hands, a couple claps. So first I will focus on the feet and then we will learn what we will do with our feet. So as you can see, I'm barefoot, right? You can do this body percussion combination barefoot or with socks or if you wanna do with street shoes, that's also okay, okay? I guess that's depend on, that depends on the floor that you are you are doing it. So whatever feel more comfortable for you, okay? So to start teaching you the feet, I'll face the back so then you can see exactly what I'm doing through the back. So I will start stepping on my right and giving a little kick with my left. So I'll do a step over here, step, and then I do this kick with my left. Then I will do a step on my left and I step on my right. So one more time, I step on my right, step, kick, and then I go back in left, right. And then I start doing the same thing with the left leg. So I do step, kick, and then I go back on right, left. So it's always like this, right, left, left, right, and then left, right, right left right left left right left right right left and if we are counting this combination it always starts like just before the one so if we are doing one two three four and one and two and three So before one, two, three, before this, one, two, three, four. So now that we know what we are doing with our feet, let's learn what we are doing with our claps. And the claps will be uh, divided in two types of claps that we are doing. High claps and low claps. What do I mean by high claps and low claps? Uh, I'm meaning the sound that they are making, right? So if I want a higher pitch, I'm clapping just like this. I'm keeping my hand just like this, and I'm clapping my four fingers over here, right in the center of my clap. So, yeah, we have a higher pitch. Try it out. 
there you go. And if I if I want a, like a lower sound, a lower a lower pitch for my claps, I'll make two cups with my hands, just like this. Open up a little bit and clap just like this. Try it out. So high claps, low claps. And the clap combination will go just like this. So I was just doing the clap combination in a little in a little loop so you guys have an idea of the music phrase that we have. But we are doing high, high low, high, high, high again, high, high low, high, 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 high low, high, 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 high low. We are counting, the clap will sit in our counting just like this. One, two, three, four. Hey, high, high, low, high, high, high. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Four. One, two, three Four. So now that we know what we what our claps are doing, and now that we know what our feet is doing, it's time to put them together, right? Um, and that's the tricky part, right? Because we need to figure it out where the claps match the feet, and like where the feet is just doing by itself, and when the clap is doing by itself. But we will do it really slow and figure it out together how they match and how they don't match. Okay. So I'll face the back so you guys can have a better view for my feet. And one, two, and three, four, and one, two, and three, four, and one, two, and three, four, and one, two, and three, four. And our claps start in the head of the one. One, two, and three, four, one, two, three, and four, and one, two, and three, four, one, two, and three, and four, and one, two, and three, four, one, two, and three, four, one. Two and three and four and one, two and three, four, one, two and three and four. So the feet will start before our clap. So I will do feet, right? So I did my feet, my feet on my right, kick and clap at the same time, and then I will do step with the clap. And then a low clap over here with my right, and then a high clap in the end without any steps. So one more time, I will step on my right, no clap, and then I will do the clap with the kick. And then I will step and clap my second high clap. On my left is my step, and then I will do my step on my right and do my low clap. And then I will do just my high clap without any steps. One, two, three, four, and one. One more time. One, two, three, four, and one. One more time, just that. One, two, three, four. And then to finish, I will do feet, feet, clap, feet, feet, clap. So I will do my step on my left, feet, feet, and then I will do my clap, clap, and then I will do feet, feet, and clap. So musically, it will be just this. One, two, three, hey. This is the second part of our phrase. One more time, just that. One, two, three, hey. 
Putting those two phrases together really slow. Here we go. One, two, three, hey. Yes, very good. Let's do one more time. One, two, three, hey. And remember that I said that we are doing three and a break, right? So this little phrase that we just taught, that we put the feet and the clap together, is our one phrase. So we'll repeat that three times. Can we try to do that? Just three times together? I'll face the back and we will do that together. One, super slow. One, two, three, hey. Hey. Very good. Let's learn the break now. Uh, and the feet, my feet, will keep doing the same thing I've been doing all over and over and over. So if I start stepping on my right, right, left, left, right, left, right, right, left. Always like this. Always like this. But my break on my claps will be a little different. Uh, so I will start actually right after um, right after I finish with my feet um, on my break. So basically, what I'm trying to say is that when we do the break, we don't have anything matching together. Like my feet are never clapping with my claps at the same time. So it's always feet, feet, clap, clap, feet, feet, clap, clap, feet, feet, clap, feet, feet, clap. Okay? So my break we will start with my feet again because we started before the one. So I will do and one with my feet, and then I will do clap, uh, a high clap, sorry, clap, and I snap on my left, snapped, okay? So I will do, one more time, one, two, three, hey, and from here I do bow change, low high, so, Right, left, clap, snap, and then left, right, low, high. Okay, one more time. One, two, three, A. One, two, three, hey. One, two, three, hey. And then from here, I will finish the same way I was finishing uh, the first part of the other phrase. It's, I will do to finish the phrase. So one more time. To finish, I will just do. Let's put this whole part of the break together. So we are doing this, starting just with the feet. One more time. One, two, three, A. One more time. One, two, three, hey. Got the break? Let's do the break a little, a couple times. One, two, one, two, three. Hey. Again, two, here it comes break. Yes, guys, now that we know our break and our phrases, let's try to put them together. So let's go. One, two, one, two, three, four, and one. Great job, guys. How does that feel? So-so? 
Let's do it a little, little slower. So then we can speed it up with the time, okay? One, two, three, four. Hey. the whole thing in a row. No stopping. How does that sound? Good? One, two, one, two, three, hey! appreciate it um, and right now since you did such a great job I will share with you guys a little choreography that I did okay um, some choreography that I set on my company that calls music from the soul um, and this choreography is part of a larger show called Partido um, I hope you guys enjoy it see you soon <laughs> 